Please round the stage, it's Marcus Ako! Start clock. Hello everyone, my name is Marcus. My dad is Nigerian, so I think that's probably the reason all my emails automatically go to spam. <laughs> you send one email to your cousin asking for his bank details and you get put on a list or something, I don't know. My mother is half English, half Italian. Uh, yeah, yeah. And, any Italians in the house? Yeah. Hey, you're not gonna like this left bit. <laughs> I'll tell you what, it's not about you and it's not about all Italians. It's just that particular part of the Italians. They're slightly racist, right? Uh, so we try not to bring it up in public quite a lot, except when Italy are doing well in the World Cup. Then it's in Napoli, where love is king. Roberto Baggio, go Lazio! And then they get knocked out, and then it's like, ah, frickin' racists. Just... <laughs> I think it's the Italian gene in my genetic mix-up that makes me look... ethnically ambiguous is the term. Um, I've been confused for Hispanic. The guy at the bar called me Indian. And, <laughs> and in one very unfortunate situation, I got called white. <laughs> in blackface. <laughs> that is the last time I go to a costume party in Maidenhead. I'm sorry, Zim Zam, I, take, I thought I knew you from somewhere. I didn't want to say anything, but, uh, uh, so. But it has its advantages looking like this. It does. I love looking ethnically ambiguous. When I go on holiday to places, usually in the Southern Hemisphere, I get treated like I'm one of the locals. The downside is, I get treated like I'm one of the locals. So, I don't have the threat of being kidnapped when I go to Mexico on my honeymoon, but I do get asked by a large number of people to clean the pool and fix their toilets <laughs> at the resort. So it swings and roundabouts. I mean, I gotta take the good with the bad, right? So. <laughs> I'm married. Um, but again, you're not gonna like the rest of these jokes. <laughs> my wife and I have been married for 15 years. Seriously, you are not gonna like where this is headed, okay? So, my wife and I have what my mother calls a mutually antagonistic relationship. What that means is we like to take the piss out of each other for jokes. I'll tell you, what, one thing I said recently, right? And I, this is an old joke, I just said to her, I did the calculation, and if I had been, married, like, if I'd been uh, sent to prison for manslaughter on the day we got married, I'd be a free man now. I thought that was funny, right? And then she said, yeah, yeah. but then this is, this is her response. She said, yeah, and with that ass, you'd have had more sex in jail. <laughs> she said, yeah, thanks. You can touch it later. You can't, you can't, I'm, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No, no one can touch this ass. Um, I said, I, I said, I'll ramp it up. I said, you know what? I think we've been married for a long time. I think it's time I go and have sex with other women. Her response is, great. Pick the woman, I'll drive you to her house, I'll wait five minutes, and I'll drive you back afterwards. <laughs> we can get some KFC on the way. She once told me, in front of company, that the best orgasm she had in our marriage was once when she was on top and I was at work. Mutually antagonistic relationship. We have three kids, they're three boys. The oldest is light-skinned black. Uh, the other two are, I guess, white with great tans. <laughs> so again, right, in the joking sense, she started this one. Um, she said, notice how with every subsequent child that we have, they seem to be getting lighter in skin tone. And then in a card, she wrote to me, dear husband, your sperm and my eggs are just like colonial history, where once again, 
the English and the Portuguese are repressing the blacks. <laughs> Happy anniversary. <laughs> Kasako finalist number one. And that was today's video. Don't forget to click subscribe and hit the notification bell to be prompted when a new video comes out. And don't forget to follow me on social media, ION Comedy on Twitter and ION Comedy Circuit on Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. Okay, bye bye.